Hello YouTube, I'm back with uh, going to be a, a bit of an odd video, kind of a triple threat this time. Package and pickles video, a uh, gameplay video, and also a response video. And the reason why is it's um, uh, the latest SMS quest that uh, Ninja Bear Hunt put up, and tying into that, uh, a pickle video he did, prompted me to pick up an item myself. And as such, I'll use that item to reply to his SMS quest item, which if you've seen the videos it will make sense, if not it probably sounds like complete gibberish, so get on with it. Well, Karabushi, if you check out that, the name of that video, no not Karabushi, I have that in mind because someone mentioned a BBC show called that to me, and Pickety Uppity or something like that, there was a, a studio that did a video called Pickety Uppity, I got a knife so I got something to open, Urgh aggressive looking and um, must not kill self with knife and in it he got this um, a Sega foot pedal well it's not actually Sega foot pedal it's a uh, quick joy quick joy foot pedal I guess so as the name and the picture probably let you tell this is a kind of a pedal controller so you can replace button presses with these I don't know pedals that you press with your feet now obviously it's designed for racing games, although they do say, um, no, that's the French site, flip it over, English, that's good, yeah. Um, ba -ba 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 -ba. An enhancement to your joystick or joypad, particularly suitable for car racing, kung fu games, and the like. And the like! How lazy! And the like! Transforms your home TV games machine into a genuine arcade game center. So yeah, apparently it's ultra robust and whatnot. But the reason, the reason why Stu picked this up is for racing games. And that makes sense. I, I could sort of see Kung Fu. And in particular, he spoke about the Master System. And Master System racing games typically have, um, I'm trying not to kill myself while I'm doing this, they typically use up and down as buttons. Not great, uh, not great buttons to use really for acceleration and whatnot, or gear changing, because when you're when you're trying to steer around the corner left and right, you typically end up pressing up or down, so you end up increasing or decreasing your speed as you don't mean to. So there we go, it was sealed. Look, an unsealing on camera. Uh, geez, the second one recently. That's crazy. Uh, when, you know, it's kind of like you know Pringles. Once you pop, you can't stop. Oh, and the original price was on it too. Fairly worn sticker, 20, 25 quid. But this cost 15, and while I'm at it, actually, I may as well mention where I got it. I got it from. Uh, they don't say it here, do they? Don't think it's. Yeah, they do actually. I got it from the Attic Bug, um, eBay reseller, and they usually go to festivals. I believe they're going to the Revival Festival in Wolverhampton on the. Where's the date? 18th and 19th of May, so if you're in Wolverhampton, check out the Revival uh, show. This show would be good. Um, but the Ashwick Bug, yeah, they, they seem to have like, plenty of old new stock type thing. And this was £15 there. So, when I seen Stuart picking up, I thought it looked pretty good, and I also threw in a note. Um, hello, thank you for your purchase purchases. We hope that you've bought, um, or what you've brought meet your expectations. If not, Please let us know before leaving a neutral or negative feedback as we will do everything in our power to sort out uh, the issues out. Are you on Facebook? If so, please come visit us there. It's an easy way to not only stay in touch with us, but you'll also be the first to know about any sales and new additions. Many thanks, Dave and Anna. Now, certainly it seems that they're a very professional outfit. Price is a tad on the high side, but you know, they are resellers. Um, it is a business. It's, you know, fair enough. And they do seem to have good customer service. Now I got this with something else, for another day, not in this video, it's only a small item, but um, I kind of threw it in to kind of bundle up the shipping because being shipped to Ireland it was, you know, I knew it was going to be heavy. So then I got an email kind of saying, oh, it's uh, going to be overweight on shipping, I'm thinking, are you kidding me, the other thing is so light, how could I possibly be putting it overweight? But uh, then I, before I even got to reply, I seen like both of them would be marked as batched, I was quite confused. So I sent an email back to them and, and said, uh, Sir, have these been sent or what's the story? And they said, yeah, yeah, we actually meant to send that to someone else. Apologies for the confusion, whatever. So they arrived, 
Fine condition, no problem. I think it could have been signed for, I can't remember. Let's get it open. Oh, it could even, the box, I don't know if this will come out on camera, printed October 1992, so that's when this was sealed up or manufactured. It smells it too. And there we have it the pedal controller. So you flip these down, Oop, oh, the other way around, I think it. You flip these down, or flip them up, I guess, and there are your buttons. Click, click, click. And you have your little control panel here to um, basically map the buttons together. So, and this is the Sega version. So you have um, basically a male and female connector. There's the male and there's the female. So you plug your, your joypad or your other controller into this one and you plug this straight into the unit itself. So of course you'll still want to say steer or whatever and that's why you need the extra controller. So there we go. That's the, the joypad. Um, and they have an instruction thingy. Just put this down. Put the packaging away. Now, sure Stu went through all this. There we go, how to how to set it up. It's actually basically what's on the box, so nothing exciting there. Just an example configuration. Put the uh, seal with the price sticker in there, so I'll we'll know it was 25 99 in uh, 1982, 1992. But the reason why Ninja Bear got this was because he wanted to play racing games with this. The Sega handle controller for the Master System. Well, actually, I guess it's for anything, but it, it's predominantly for the Master System. So this is what they would call a mixture between a flight stick and a, a race controller. Pretty cool looking, and you you know steer it left and right like that. And it has two fire buttons up here. Again, suitable for the Master System. However, it has one crippling flaw. To press to go press either the up or down, you have to pull the stick out and in like this which really, really doesn't work very well at all. Uh, I know they were trying to simulate the kind of flying yoke control, but it's just, it's, it, it's not built enough to be jerked around like that. And it would have been better if they had two buttons here at the back of the handle, so that you could press to, as an alternative. So, it, I've played it a bit when I got it, because actually, when I got my first Mass System bundle, that kind of kick-started me on the road to the full set, this was included in it. It was one of the reasons I went for it, because I thought, oh, that looks like a very interesting uh, peripheral, and you don't see it all that often. And I played with it, but it's just, without being able to press up and down, mo almost all the mass system race games are completely unplayable. And that's where, of course, its controller comes in. You can map up and down the button presses. So, a really good combination, and that's what Stuart used for, um, for his latest... Uh, SMS quiz. How can I not remember the name? And that was Taito's um, SCI. Not to be confused with Taito. That's a bag of crisps. Taito, SCI. So I'm going to do a video response to this. Now, if editing goes well, it'll be at the end of this video or just after a second, you know, ba ba ba, after the jump. If not, it'll be a separate video. But before I go, I just remembered one thing. If you're thinking of getting one of these handle controllers, make sure it comes with its cable because its connector is not a standard SMS connector. It's got like this wider port with more pins. Now it completely operates like a Masterson controller, but you need this cable. So word of warning, I guess. But anyway, let's go set all this stuff up. Sega love you setting all this stuff up. Imagine sticking this up to your Sega Tower of Doom. Yes, wires and cables everywhere. Digital delight. And with that, let's go set up. Okay, so here we are with uh, SCI set up. Got the handle controller, got the foot pedal thing, wires everywhere, but it but it's set up and hopefully the camera is pointing at the screen. <laughs> Just to add to the troubles. Um, there we go, press start. If not, we can, uh, it seems okay, press start button. And when I say SCI, I always think of CSI now. Of course, this well predates it, so, Player's car, T-bar roof, V6, DOHC, 3000cc, twin turbo engine. 
I'll be chasing after the bad guys in no time. Something's girl is fleeing toward the dot dot dot. Suburbs, get moving. Well, there's no dot dot dots to be fair in this sex. Over. Over and out. So, there we go. I've set um, up and down to the foot pedals left and right. And then steering with the handle controller. And then firing with the, uh, with the fire buttons, which makes sense. Oh, crap. Don't want to go into those missiles. Probably best to just avoid these guys instead of trying to shoot them like mad. I don't know, you got a gun and uh, it feels natural to shoot. Now, this is a racing game, so I should probably focus more on racing. Or what? Is this really a racing game or is it a racing action game? In fact, I don't even know if you can kill those guys because they never seem to die. Okay, those tunnels come out crap on camera, so must not go through too many tunnels. Oh, you can bounce the cars away, which is good, I guess. Gets them off your tail somewhat. Or out of your lane. Out of my way! I'm the SCI! So, okay. So we've got a fair bit of distance to go. Gotta get through this tunnel. Terrible, terrible screen quality. And we're back. But so far this is handling pretty well. Hey, I knocked him off onto the uh, onto the, the gr greenery. Oh, I went off myself trying to get those shots. Okay, so I've been holding off on using the, on the, the the turbo boost, which is button two, and that's why uh, up and down are, are accelerate and brake is because you use one and two to fire your guns. Oh, oh, we're at the uh, we're at the bad guy. There's one shot in. Two shots. Three shots. Four shots. Come on, get him, get him, get him! Gotcha! That went well. Get him again, just make sure! <gasps> Stage complete! Nice bit of bonus too! Stop talking rubbish! Uh, but, but I thought it was a nice bit of bonus. Guess I know nothing. High powered item, rocket launcher, five shots. Didn't we just already get that? So what's it? What's new? Anyway, channel four. Lots of promo from channel four. A station wagon has been spotted on the William Shatner delivery coastline freeway with a girl aboard. Go after. So let's go. I just feel inclined to shoot all the time as well. But if I'm standing out of the car shooting, I guess... How am I controlling the car? Maybe he's got a foot pedal and... Uh, well, I mean, obviously in the car you would have foot pedals. I was referring to the controller, though. But how is he reaching at all? Hmm. Oh. And I have a controller works rather nicely, actually, when it's... Well, it's relieved of its duties for um, up and down. Because those buttons never worked well. Oh, you. Ah, damn. Stupid helicopter. How do you know the good helicopters versus the bad helicopters? Well, I guess the ones that shoot at you are. It's a fairly good signal that they're bad, but. Oh, into the landslide, nice. Avoided three. You don't seem to be penalised too much for going off road, which is which is good. Oh. I wonder can you fire those guys off into the water? Because you can, like they're nearly off. Oh, got me a. Oh yeah, don't don't shoot now. I need that for the bad guy, right? Yeah. Now I gotta drive. Ah. Uh. Okay, well, hopefully we're getting up to him, because we're down to 10 seconds to go, so... There we go. Try and get a bit closer before we launch our high-powered rockets. Oh. Oh, Jesus. Guess I'm just going to have to go for it. Stuck in a pattern.
He's gonna take a fair lot of damage now. Damn, I really wish I didn't waste those uh, those missiles. Come on, ram him. You gotta be careful though, ram him at the side of the ocean. I don't wanna go off myself. Forty-five seconds to go to half time. I think I knocked the other car off though. So you can knock them off. That's cool. Okay, well, we're not doing too bad on time. Slow down, slow down. Jesus, with your regular shot, oh, I'm on nearly off. <laughs> with your regular shot, he sure takes a lot of hits. Come on, ram him. Yes, there we go. No crime that I can't bust. Buddy, you got it wrong. I can't bust this crime. I'm not Bob. This little girl isn't Bob. I okay, guess she's not. The one you want. She's not the one that I want. Do -do 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 -do. So I gotta watch out for landslides. And I'm sure I'll go after someone. Oh, road signs in the road. That's that's not good. Well, they didn't seem to do much. Damn these tunnels! Don't they know that in 20 years' time, people will be recording direct off TV capture for a, you know an online video sharing service? It's so inappropriate of them to to set the game up like that. Oh, I knocked them off the edge too. Ah, nice. This is a pretty fun game actually. I didn't really give it much of a chance when I got it because I've actually heard uh, generally bad reviews. <laughs> And, you know, people saying, oh, you just breeze through it out, or it's not really anything, you know, great about it. I can understand back in the day, if you buy a game, and you're done 20 minutes later, you'd be pretty peeved. But, having watched uh, Ninja Bear Hub's playthrough, you know, it's a fun game. And, oh, damn. This is not good. Out of the way. I'll use one of my turbos to try and get back up to some sort of speed. Jesus. Um... I have to use another turbo actually because I'm way off. 20 seconds to go. And the last level is a bit tricky to, to say the least. Oh no. Are you the bad helicopter again? Oh no, you're the good helicopter. Oh sh, a girl lumps. Oh right, don't use those, damn. Jesus, I got those fairly pretty early on in the level. Don't you know that it's it's awkward to race without my rockets? Come on. Time to turbo again. Come on. Oh. This is gonna be... No, not looking good. Oh, just about. <laughs> One second to go. I even managed to get my rockets up from... I did not think... Oh, that's not good. Are we racing on the water now? What's this all about? Go, go, go. I have to say, it's hard to uh, ascertain what I can race on. So I do not think I'll be getting this guy. Oh, we're shooting the wrong guy. No, 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 not those guys. The blue guy. This is like the old Mars ad. The red car and the blue car had a race. I'm getting a bit of damage into him now. Ah, oh, shit. Didn't see this landslide. I wish I had a few of those turbos now. Oh, that was lucky. Oh, no! Thankfully, he seemed to slow down as well. Slides. He loves driving through them. Won't get much bonus if I make it to the end this time, but sure, let's just try and make it to the end. Come on. 
thankfully, I don't seem to have a, like a damage meter to. Oh, there we go. Otherwise, I'm sure I'd be well dead from driving into all these cars. I want my attorney. I ain't gonna say. Not until he comes. You think they could fit two lines of text? Watch out for the hill, it appears three times. Okay. What level is this? Oh, stage four. Not too bad. Oop. Out of the way, drums out of the way. How do you get points for avoiding them versus shooting them out of the way? A nice wide road to start with. Oh, crud. That bus fairly made a quick work of me. Oh, damn it. Oh, <laughs> this is not going well. And our turbo. I still seem to have three turbos, oh, one's faded off now. Would like to save them to get the bonus, but... After crashing three times into street lights and whatnot... Not gonna happen. Out of my way! There's a criminal I have to apprehend. I don't care if you're a law-abiding citizen. Why do I always fire those as soon as I get... Oh no, I used my turbo into the bloody thing. That's not good. Should have used it here during the tunnel. Oh. Ah, oh, screw it. I'm not getting to the, to the guy in this one, I'd say. No! Oh. oh, well. No, we'll leave it there. Oh, good fun, good fun, and an enjoyable game, and definitely works well with the with the controller setup. So yeah, hard to recommend because it requires a lot of paraphernalia, some of which is not easy to get. There we go. I got two and a half million. Not too shabby, I guess, but uh, certainly not the nine million <laughs> Stuart got. But we'll see you again with another video soon.